his progress. So remember this. <laughs> now this pH 640 is normal. 640 for saliva and 640 for urine. The top number is the urine. 640. Now, it's about 6.4. It's 640. Well, I, 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 use the, I use the 40 because I many times have a 5 or a 8 or a 2 or something. Yeah. I'll tend to put the 0. You can say 6.4 for short if you want to. Now, on this, uh, on this test, I would suggest, and believe me, that's from years of experience, that you let the electric meters alone on this. Many, many times you're going to find them the same. But there is that one here, yonder, and there that were critical and it will upset you terrifically. And you can lose a patient. So stick to this known system of measuring it because this will not pick up the metallic substances in it. Now I'll tell you where you're missing. A person is living in an area of a high mineral content in the water, like iron or aluminum, and so forth. It'll, it, it will not give you the same reading. And don't, I'm just I'm advising you from hard years of experience. Uh, I, I have never let it happen to me, but I've seen cases that it could have happened to me by using their pH meters. Use the solutions, and the, in that they are safe. They're safe, and you know what you're doing, because they will, this solution will not pick up the metallic content. Uh, it will only measure the amount of, uh, of actually acidic acid and other kind of acids, and it'll let the minerals alone. 